Hi everyone, so today's video is going to be about teenage acne and it's a, su a subject that I know a lot of you probably really struggle with or struggled with and it's something that can really knock your confidence and be really upsetting and I will kind of admit that I never really suffered from acne, not even as a teen, um, but these are just a few things that I feel like will help and when I do have the odd breakout then these are what I turn to. Now what, there's a difference between proper acne and just having the occasional breakout so if you feel like you've got a really really serious problem then definitely go and see a dermatologist but I used to always get breakouts on my forehead which were kind of oil and sweat related and then now I don't get those now I sometimes get them on my kind of chin and nose which is hormonal or on my jawline which is stress related if I'm stressed my jawline goes crazy it's very funny but I've just got a couple of products here and a couple of tips and tricks that are going to help you. And I just want to start off by saying as well that no matter how bad you think it is, it's never as bad. We're always our worst critics and we always think that it's much, much worse than it is. It isn't. It's not, you know, what you think it is. You don't look like a grotesque monster. It's fine. But there are a couple of things that you can do that can help the situation. But bearing in mind that everyone's skin is different, I can't 100% guarantee that what I'm suggesting will work for you. So the first thing you want to make sure is to make sure your hands are clean. Now I know this sounds really strange, but you touch your face a lot, you've got dirty hands, you've got grease on your hands, you've got kind of bits of dirt under your nails, you scratch your face, you're transferring dirt and Whereas different types of acne can kind of be coming from the inside, you can aggravate them more by keep getting them infected and getting bacteria in there. So make sure your hands are always clean, wash your hands frequently, carry around a hand sanitizer with you to make sure your hands are always clean so you're not infecting anything. In terms of kind of products that I think are really, really effective, the first one is this one by Neutrogena. I know this is a well of product everywhere, but it's the Visibly Clear 2-in-1 Wash and Mask, which looks like this. My sister absolutely swears by this, and she's 15 and she's got really perfect, lovely skin. It doesn't work for everybody, but for me this does really work, and I did have kind of a few weird... Um, breakouts going on on my cheeks earlier and they have completely kind of gone obviously I've got makeup on so you can't really tell but they have gone completely and it was all down to this it's a fantastic fantastic product you can use it as a mask it's got um, different types of acid in it that are going to help it's clay based so it absorbs oil and it's not harsh and that's something that I want to touch on as well using very harsh alcohol rich products are just going to make it worse in some cases I feel like your skin is just sensitive and that's why it's breaking out and using things that are very heavily fragranced or very heavily chemical can sometimes aggravate the problem and just make it worse make it produce more oil and cause more problems so try and treat your skin gently I know it's really tempting to just hack away at it and get things to just try get and try making your skin super kind of clean and stripped and using very alcohol rich products and I feel like sometimes that can just have the opposite effect so really really do be careful with that kind of thing if you need to wear a moisturizer and I do suggest everyone wears a moisturizer during the day and the evening go for an oil free moisturizer look for words like matte and oil free definitely don't use something that's heavily fragranced but just because you've got acne doesn't mean that your skin doesn't still need moisture this one's really lovely and Emmy in fact is a brand that feels really great for teens in general because it's quite gentle but this is their morning dew matte finish moisturizer which looks like this and this is a really lovely product it's got vitamin E in it and it just helps to kind of regulate the oil in your skin and won't make your skin feel greasy and I do definitely suggest wearing a sunscreen all the time no matter what but this is one that I really love but you do want to be careful I've tried to kind of keep everything um, relatively inexpensive as well because there are some products that I think are really great but are very expensive and I know that most teens don't have the budget for that but this is the Emmy Skin Shield Daily Moisturiser with SPF 15 I do recommend wearing an SPF it's very important but um, one thing to mention about this is that it has got um, kind of shimmer particles in it which might enhance the look of your acne even more so that's something to be aware of but um, if you just want some sort of sun protection this is a really really great cheaper product. Then in terms of treatment and things like that, I've got a couple of face masks and that kind of thing. But first of all, when it comes to removing your makeup, as I said with the moisturiser, wanting to keep everything oil-free, use an oil-free makeup remover as well. This one is by Emmy again, and it's the 
bright eyes, very gentle makeup remover. It's just an eye makeup remover, but they do various ones. Try and stay away from wipes and things like that because they're not really cleansing your skin. But in terms of treatments, I've got two face masks here that are really good. The first one is by The Sanctuary. I swear by this. I feel like this is great for breakouts. Some people love it and some people say it does nothing so it does very depend on how your skin will react but it's the sanctuary deep cleanse facial five minute thermal detox i've pretty much used this up this is how much i love it i think it's just an amazing amazing fantastic product and i would recommend it to everybody and then the other one is by emmy again i promise you i'm not sponsored by emmy it's just that i feel like they're very good for teenage skin um the spring clean cooling clay mask and this is a really nice mask it's kind of a proper old school green mask it smells like lemonade it's got really kind of nice smell and you smooth it all over your skin and it will kind of help to just get the oiliness away but it's not harsh if you do want to treat your skin with kind of targeted spot treatment, then again, this one by Emmy is great. I did used to really rate the Clean Clear one, but I have found that for me personally, it makes my skin peel kind of around it. So I do have to be careful with that one. But the Clean and Clear Fast Advantage, I think it's called, is great as well. But this is the Emmy All Clear Instant Action Spot Clearing Gel. The reason I like this is because you can apply it onto the affected area and it'll help to just get your spot down and make it not as red and that type of thing but it doesn't aggravate the skin it doesn't kind of burn the skin around and make it all dry and flaky because that's something that I definitely suffer with um, and I did suffer and I would just kind of apply it everywhere and apply very harsh products I did used to use the oxy spot treatment and it just kind of burnt my skin off it was terrible so be very very careful and don't be impatient kind of use products regularly have a good skincare regime drink lots of water sleep properly sleep is so important for your skin my skin breaks out like crazy if I'm not sleeping enough so that's very important and then in terms of makeup wearing as little makeup as possible is probably the best for your skin but if you have got acne I know you won't be feeling as confident and you'll want to kind of cover things up with makeup so there are a couple of things here that I think are really good this is the 17 on the spot foundation and this is a very very cool product because this actually has got salicylic acid in it and it's got kind of new technology that's going to help rectify your spots I've done a full review of this so I will put that in the down bar but they say that it'll give you clearer skin in four weeks I don't know how effective it is at kind of really clearing acne because as I said it's not a problem that I personally struggle with but it's a very very nice product it's quite natural looking but it's still got a decent amount of coverage and it won't make you look cakey so I really suggest this and then for concealer this is the W7 cover stick with tea tree oil which is really cool because tea tree oil is great for treating um, spots and this is just what it looks like it's just a stick concealer and you can just apply this on kind of targeted areas and smooth it out with your fingers and you might not even need foundation and then another really fantastic concealer that covers things really well is the collection lasting perfection concealer which looks like this I'm sure you all know what this looks like but it's just a little doe for applicator and you can just dab it onto the affected areas and it will really help smooth everything out and make your skin look even. But those are my top tips. So if you want to take everything, anything from this video, then remember to drink lots of water, sleep well and be patient. Don't attack your skin because it will just make things worse and your skin will be red and it'll make everything more obvious. Be gentle, be thorough, make sure your skin's always clean and if you are really, really stressed about it, then go and see somebody go and see a dermatologist they might be able to help you I don't know very much about taking acne medication but I would always be very wary with any type of medication in general so really research it before you decide to do anything and I'd love to know your experiences with these types of um, products or this kind of issue so if you've had bad acne please let us know what worked for you and if you've tried something that didn't work for you it could be a warning for others as well so definitely get commenting down below and don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I will see you all in my next video